Hello everyone, we are playing the scenario Dark Fire, scenario 7A of After the Storm, episode 3. We've got to open the main access gate, which is just a terrifyingly horrifying scenario objective. And in order to do that, we need to, first of all, clear out this room. So there's some kind of nasty stuff here. There's a dog. Um, there are some other units, um, some of which can't reach me yet. These two, three at the back can't. Uh, actually, these four at the back can't. Um, these other five can. So I feel like forming a line along here is the answer. Try not to lose anyone. We've got a gunner here. I guess the best way to deal with the gunner is in melee. Do I have enough units to defeat them and still form a line? Maybe not, but if not, I can leave Elinia at the top because she's tanky. Oh, that was good. Okay, um, Nimmer and the uh, Demoness Grunt. Now if you come here... Deal some damage. Or maybe I should have slowed with Alinea. I didn't, anyway. So then you, you're here. Actually, you... Try and zap. Perfect. And then the five units that can reach me... I can actually block them all off. You're both... neither of you are super tanky. Uh, but no one here is going to be attacked by more than two units. And I think... Uh, well, except unless the dog... We have to... we have to... yeah, we have to account for the dog. I might just... it's very tempting just to... Given that these guys can't then reach a linear, it's very tempting just to take a linear up and defeat the dog before anything else happens. Because only then only the top these four units can reach her, and I think if she's on a seventy percent or sixty percent defense castle tile, she should be all right. Yeah, all right, I'll do that. There we go. No damage for a linear. And now we'll see what damage everyone else takes. You can't reach. You can't reach. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of fighting going on. Oh! No, 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 no. Okay. Great. <laughs> Turn one of combat and I've lost one of my loyals. Brilliant. Um, well, I'm just going to have to play on and uh, see what happens, I think. Ah, it's this bastard that um, that got me. I'd forgotten all about him. So let's get the people who are a bit squishier in the background. And over here... Can use a linear to slow this guy. And kill the guy if, if she hits with all her attacks as she did. Fantastic. Okay, then you come and do some cold damage. You hop down there. You go up there. Still three units who can't reach anything, along with three who can, and a linear will un inevitably take the bulk of the damage here, unless they all decide to gang up on Nymerin, which they might. Oh, hello. Do I need to retreat into the corridor? Oh. Oh. Yeah, looks like it. There's too many units here for me to comfortably defeat. So run away, run away everyone. 
This is not the best defensive position, but it'll do. We've got 87 turns after all. Hopefully that means I can afford to be at least somewhat wasteful. Yeah, you better run. Fantastic. Okay, let's do that again. And again, and again. They don't want to come and fight me. Okay, well I guess I'm just going to have to go for it. You come back here. Deal a little bit of damage to this guy. And I guess Alinea, you'd best get the kill. There we go, and now you can get uh, an extra fairy fire strike. Is that that will really make her powerful? Eleven four range damage. That's what I need in order to blast through obstacles in a dungeon scenario. Okay, um, I've not made a very clever fly, and I think that means that my Roll will probably end up dying on 30% defense. Um, or should I? You've got 36 hit points. No one here can actually one shot you. So you just wait behind and you can tank the damage. actually range, but for some reason you don't seem to want to come forward and fight. I guess you're not very strong. I love the fact that there's a level 2 unit with just 5-3 melee damage. You're a bit beaten up, so just you kill your counterpart, and then we'll block you with other units, other tankier units. a risky thing to do, but the trolls are pretty tough. I'm tempting to just retreat with you, but then this skirmisher will be able to have its way. These three are still out of range, so it's really just you two and the skir and the headhunter. Um, hmm. Yeah, gonna retreat. Actually, can you get round? You can get round to there. You can get to there as well. Yeah, all right. You just you just dodge backwards. And let's see. Not a troll. Okay, the enemy's really unlucky. Well, that's good. out with a linear. Almost kill this guy. Get the kill with Demon Grunt, who's the one that's tooled up with all the gear. And then...
we'll put you up here to heal Alinea. And then hopefully you... Oh. Yep, just... Twatted. And then you go up here. Alright, we're good. And none of these units want to move out. Interesting. Well, I don't have the best range on them. And I have to consider my position. Especially given that there's a Magus here. So I feel like I should move forward, make a line. Keep the Saurian safe and kill this guy. Who wants to be on the front line? Someone who's tough against Arcane. Um, that's not really you, but you're just you're tough by virtue of having huge amounts of hit points. On the other hand, you guys can reach and aren't attacking, so maybe. Maybe I should just go for it. Two units that can only reach the Blood Imp. Start with you. Okay, there is another unit here. There's a Grunt. That changes things, because Grunts are nasty. Trolls, I think, if I remember right, yeah, they're super weak against Arcane, so you could just get pretty much one-shotted by this guy, even with only even with his 7-4. Still. Go down you go. Now everyone will want to kill you. Just gonna leave you where you are. Okay, now they come in. Yeah, they're gonna go for the troll. Bad luck. And the troll survives. And if the troll can get a level 2 kill, then it should be able to make it out of here. usually use a linear to tank damage, but in this case I'm going to do something a bit more chaotic. Alright. No, you'd need to be very lucky to get that kill, wouldn't you? Can I bring you in? Now, if I hit you with both staff attacks, that would bring you down to be killable by the troll. And if not, this troll might still kill you in two hits. So let's try that. <coughs> yes. All right. You could attack Nimarin, and you might do. Let's see. Too tempted by pointlessly attacking the troll. Have a cold off. Who else do I want to level up? Mainly it's just you now. Okay, so you come around here and whack this bowman. Whack him good. Very whacked. 
Now you come around this side. Uh, maybe get the slow stun effect. So that hopefully. It's not super effective. Two hits here will do it. Uh, oh well. How fast are you? Fast enough. Risky. Fireballs. Okay. You go there. You can come out and attack who you like. Ow! You better stay behind. Good, good. Now... You advance. You get the kill. You advance. You could go up to this guy and whack him over the head. Tempting. Let's just go up there anyway. Just block him in. Better that than have him come out and attack my Zephyr and have to deal with the consequences of that. Now unless there are invisible units around, you might be better served hopping forward one. Alright, now time to kill the Hell Guardian. We'll get everyone relevant into place. You, you're too slow. You're too weak. So it's the three of us. So you go there, because it doesn't matter if you go into a corner you can't get yourself out of. You go here. This is a multi-turn jobby, so... Alright, now let's go for straightforward, good old-fashioned damage dealing. Okay, now you're super weak. I can feed your level 3 experience to my grunt, hopefully. Just need to get one of these ranged hits. There we go. And now you're not far from a level. You stay almost where you are. You just gout up this corridor a little bit. Okay, we've got rats. That's exciting. We got more gear. And they've got a heart as a castle there. I could recruit some units. That didn't even occur to me. I can, I can. Alright, let's hop in. What can I recruit? I can recruit demons, saurian augers. Saurian Skirmishers and Troll Whelps. Now, all units with their advantages and disadvantages, which probably if you've uh, listened to me playing this campaign for this long, you don't need me to explain them to you. What about recalls? I'm separated from my soldiers and may not recall them. That figures. Can you one-shot this rat? Yeah, you can. Oh, okay, but that thing is a demon as spell dancer and they're quite nasty against you so maybe it would be wise to be more careful hmm no um they're down here the only problem with troll trolls are beautiful they're a wonderful unit but um they're pretty slow so if I plan to do any serious fighting, I'm not sure how useful they will be. Saurian skirmishes, especially their advancements, could be absolutely wonderful by contrast. Um, I can recruit demons, which is the first time in this campaign that that's been possible. 
Um, so maybe I should just recruit one of everything for now. I don't actually need another auger. If I'd lost my um, my soothsayer, then that would be an issue. But so I'll get demon. I'll get skirmisher. I'll get skirmisher. I'll get one troll whelp for now. Interestingly, now I'm not out of money. I can only have eight units on the on the pitch at any one time, eight, eight allies, and so that means that I'm at my max at this point. So Alinea, you just you you guys come in and run. There's another rat out here. Yeah, hightail it into action. Don't go straight there just yet. I will need you do other things. Spell dancers, powerful, easy to hit. Leadership not gonna be a big deal around now. It hurts so much. Soothsayer, soothsayer can get in there, but won't be very happy with getting hit, so should I be more careful? Could you be killed? 33, right, if if she gets 5 hits, then she could just kill this Zephyr. Oh, she can't, okay, that's good. Uh, she's got 17 health, so I could take her out with my Soothsayer, but the Soothsayer would be very vulnerable to retaliation if I tried that. So instead I'm just going to put Alinea here, put you there, lure out this rat with Nimera and the Grunt, and everyone else come running. Now oh, you're quick, you're also intelligent, so... Um, probably either a legend or not long for this world, or both. That tends to happen to quick and intelligent units. Okay, so she tries to take on my level 3 troll. And fails. And now... Elinia can eat her for breakfast. Maybe I should have got the kill with a skirmisher, but that way seemed good. Alright, now you go. Open the gate. Ah, the gate is now open. Proceed through the main access gate. I'm going to go and fight this rat. What does this potion do? So we can find out. Ah, it's just another potion of magnificent taste. It makes a bat noise when it's hit, interestingly. What's in the box? Nothing. What's down here? Looks like more rats and boxes. Well, let's milk the rats for experience, at least. You get going. And you. You're resilient and strong, which is a cool combination. You come and lure out this rat. And you get some healing. There we are. Who keeps their access room in a storeroom? Sneaky misdirection. Also kind of inconvenient when you're just trying to get into the main base. Or like, what happens when pizza delivery guy gets there? Or um, not pizza delivery guy. Like, you know. Oh, we've got some crates of uh, crates of, of supplies. Yeah, just leave them in the storeroom. Oh, wow. What is this massive glyph and this demon spell dancer doing here? Well.
Alright, rats are clearly too much of a problem for my demon grunt. Call for my normal demon. You can kill the rat. There we go. And because you're intelligent, that's a good way towards a level for you. You're still really slow. No, you're not actually. You've got six movement. That's cool. Uh, I'm going to leave this rat, am I? Yeah. Doesn't seem like a good use of turns just going and killing one rat. Especially if it didn't want to fight. What do we see? We don't see much. Oh boy! Okay, keep going. Anyone else need healing? Only the the troll, and by the time he gets into the fight, he will be well healed. Okay, there's two Chaos Invaders here. One of them's fast enough to reach there, so I'll stick you there, put you back a bit. If you want to come out and fight, then be my guest. Next turn you'll get owned. There we go. <laughs> Pretty decent, and Alinea can kill that one, hopefully, and lure the other one. And thus I descend into the darkness of Uriah's key stronghold on Erdia. Agea's words were clear. We do not have a chance to win this war and purge the corrupted goddess's influence from this earth. Not without the power hidden beneath Kalari. I do not intend to stand watching while she turns our ruined world into breeding grounds for her invasion army. Neither could I bear to live, knowing that it is in her plans to tear another world apart and threaten our very reality to quench her dreadful thirst for power. I have to do something to prevent that. No matter the cost. Well, that's the cost. One dude, and there'll be another one following shortly. Okay, I guess if you really want to come out and fight the well, then you can. You can't kill it, or maybe someone or something else can. All right, well I won't, I won't force the issue. Everyone else is still catching up after all. Okay, you're scared to come and fight Alinea, and I can understand that. I get the, uh, I get what you're going through. Is there anyone else back here? No, there isn't. So Alinea can just come and zap you with magical powers. Not quite killing you. Alright, no progress. Do you have backstab? No, you don't. But you can still get a kill with one hit. And there's a gunner. Soon to be a goner. Let's keep advancing.
Everyone's gradually catching up. Only my powerful demoness grunt is holding up the rear. Oh, okay. Run away! Won't save you. But there are lots of gates back here. I wonder if they're all going to open and flood drones on us or something. I bet that's what's going to happen. Well, there are more gunners here. One of them can reach me. So again, let's just consolidate for now. Not do anything too rash. Doesn't look like there's anything down these side packages. I'll just just want passages. I will just check one of them out. And you keep going at full speed. Come back. Still no one wants to fight Alinea. I guess that's fine. Is she gonna run up and stand on that castle tile? Yeah, it is tempting. Especially to kill this guy who's standing well away. Okay, there's an automaton up there, but it can't reach me. Alright, one almost down. These guys are surprisingly powerful in combat, and now I need to slightly watch out. It could, could, get itself killed if everyone hits. Do these guys have weakness to pierce? No, they don't. Anyone else, can, can anyone else get there? Nope. see if there's oh okay yeah there is stuff down here and it's quite nasty and there's a magus here so you don't go down there no one go down there that's a very bad place to be you guys just line up which way looks more promising I guess I might just explore both I've got enough troops to do so is not, in fact, dead. So move it down. Okay, I was kind of hoping that wouldn't happen, but never mind. Just let me remind myself of what your res resistances are. Okay, so the best thing to use against you is impact, also fire and cold. Do I have any impact? Um, aha, I've got you. Yeah, you'll do. You guys will do very nicely taking out automata. Um, and I don't want to send you against the magus anyway, so this seems wise. And plus, you don't need healing, so you can be an autonomous team. I'll send you up with them so that you can do some fire damage to support everyone else. Um, who do I want to go toe to toe with the Magus? Um, ideally, someone who's not weak to arcane. You're resistant to arcane, so actually, this guy should not really be able to. Might be able to beat the absolute shit out of you, but cannot kill you. So let's try that. And you go back here, and you guys get ready to fight. Ok, 
Okay, not too bad. So then you come around here. Can you kill it? With three hits you should be able to. Ah! Oh, useless, okay. Alinea's gonna have to give you a hand. And even so, I can block. Okay, so you're alive, unless bats come out of nowhere, which they might do. How best now to take on this guy? Okay, 30. I guess I'll just have to take the hits from the crossbowman. That was good. New toy, throwing axe. Alright, you go there, and hopefully you'll survive. You have to not, you have to, basically if this guy misses with one shot, you'll survive. Otherwise I lose a level one. Oh! Okay, you do the most pointless thing in the world. You do you. Ah! You know what I said about units coming out of nowhere? <laughs> Fantastic! I've just lost a level 1 unit, which I also said wasn't the worst thing in the world. But that one had a ton of experience that I was feeding it, so that's quite, you know, it's a little bit aggrieving. This is the worst kind of drone, sentry drone. Oh, you trolls, where have you been all my life? Um, hmm. Is it wise? No, it's not wise to let you take that fight. I'm gonna run you away. And I have to just deal with you, and I have someone who's fairly well equipped to do so now, a level 3 demon. So you go around the back. Uh, attacking with the um, throwing axe seems less of an appealing prospect at this point. Good, and now you're on your way to a level. I can recruit one more unit if I want to. Let me just check this again. Yeah, eight allies on the map simultaneously. So I could hop back down here. Ah! Oh, crud. Panic! That was cool. I think that should be all the drones that come out of this stupid hole in the wall.
Mm. If I sit here, I can't block, can't quite block the troll from getting hit, but at least it's been slowed. Medic! You come up here. You come along here. You go that way too. I think south looks like the right way to go, so I'll go that way later. Always go the wrong way first. Where's north? Okay, we got a spire. Yeah, that looks good. Is this whole area just pointless then? I've just come up here to annoy myself? Maybe. Oh, there is a path. There is a path. Maybe there's some juicy magic. Got 60 turns left, so plenty of time to explore. Ah! Ah, and a bat! All the annoying units. Oh, and that worked so well last time. Oh shit! Okay. Good thing I moved you guys up. Whew, sheesh. Can you get in there? No. go. Any more for any more? Everyone's cured at least, but my troll is looking like he's had better days. You over here. Just check out this corpse thing next turn. Otherwise I think that's it for this nasty corner of the map. I think I'm just going to leave a few of you where you are this turn. Nope, nothing at all. Lovely. Okay, we've got uh, an Iron Golem that can come and try and fight my Demoness Warrior at its peril. And the Demoness Warrior has level 1 backup. even get in on this fight, though I'm not sure it's a great idea. Probably... Yeah, probably best leaving the level 1s to deal with this. Fourteen hit points left to go. You're not very damaging against it. Neither of you are going to level up if you get the kill. What do I want more? A level 2 demon or a level 2... Uh, never mind. Try you first. Alright, there's a Magus there. So maybe it's not so great to just go rushing in. It's only an invoker, but still. I'll try and use a linear. I should heal up that 7 damage, okay. And let's lure out the Invoker. Demons are weak to Arcane, but Saurians are not, so you can go there. And you still can't reach, okay. 
go there. Lots of stuff here. Chaos like to keep lots of drones in hidden corners, but they also like to keep random magical tut lying around too. So let's see. There you go. Um, who's good at killing invokers? You should be pretty flipping good at killing invokers. Not bad. You should be pretty good at killing this guy. You would think. Uh, only matrix flows. Ugh. Disgraceful. Okay, you. There we go. Now you can come around here. Poison axe attack. You're too slow to get the kill. So I'm going to have to use you. Uh, Linear will have to miss out on healing this turn. That's fine. Looks like there's mostly only treasure down here at the moment. It is nice to see a load of stash lying around. Can you one-shot these guys? Yeah, you can. Good. What's the gold going to do? I mean, I guess it's just gold. It's not really useful to me at the moment. You can do a good job of one-shotting these as well. That looks like it's a potion of taste. I could give that to Alinea. See what the gold does. Okay, there's a... Gotta be careful, there is an invader in there. Just a bunch of gold coins. Too bad that they are rather weighty and we have no use for them at this time. That's a sword. Um, who have I got that uses swords? No one, really. Um, everyone, demons all use axes. Um, these guys use spears and... Yeah, you don't use anything, so... Doesn't seem like a hugely useful thing to have. Legendary sword. Ah, yes. This sword, forgotten by time, once belonged to a legendary hero who presumably died in a glorious and dignified fashion, like real heroes are wont to do. Unfortunately, since then it has rusted beyond use. And as the unit picks it up, it snaps in half. The sword is now only marginally better than a small rock in combat. Not that Alinea has any units that are trade in sword fighting anyway. She does, but she didn't take them with her on this mission because she's a dumbass. Um, there's a potion of taste over there which Alinea can't quite reach. There's nothing in this chest. You come down here and help with this. Alright. Do I need to recruit anyone else? No, I'm almost at full pot. Well, not really. How many losses have I had so far? Yeah, just the two. Troll Rock while at the start, then a Saurian Skirmisher. So I, I can have a maximum of, yeah, just one more dude. Got the right end of that fight. I can let my level 1s in here and uh, they can hopefully wreak havoc. Yeah, havoc. What about this potion? Okay. This potion flask seems important. 
Let the Lady of Light come to examine it. <gasps> Alright, everyone's getting very close to a level without getting to a level. Let's get this potion of magnificent taste. Yep, one hit point healed. And you can come and kill the Matrix Flow. There's huge amounts of gold everywhere. Maybe explore this passageway as well? I don't know. I suspect it will all join up in the end. Still, what's this? Old wooden floor, it doesn't look like there's anything there. Uh, okay, maybe you, because you're basically invincible, so you go scout this way. Okay, there's a marauder. You come out and join. And here we've got an invader. I want to get out into the corridor where we won't get trapped, but then there's two invaders, but that's fine because you're tanky. Ooh! Potion of Life! This potion grants the Regenerates ability, allowing the unit to heal itself 8 8 hit points per turn or remove the poison effect. Hmm, this might prove useful later. Damn right! Okay, you can come here. Oh, we've got automata as well. Alright, a lot of units going to suicide themselves on my uh, on my combat units then. You go around this way, I might need help with the Marauder. Bit inefficient on the movement there, never mind. And now we're level 2. And everyone's loyal, so it doesn't even matter. If you fight this guy twice, you will be a good level. And I've got the ability to do a good deal of damage here. least in principle, and also take a good deal of damage. Alright, and oh, I can have troll shamans. That's interesting. Um, now, I did have a rock lover, um, but since rock lovers, I guess, didn't seem to turn out to be hugely useful, maybe a shaman is a better bet. Strong, quick, um, flame blast attack. Yeah, why not? Less hit points, but, eh, well. Okay, now here the strategy I think should be, this. these paths join up, so put some people in the way, so that the units up there don't swarm and kill me, while at the same time Maybe it's, well, it's only you two. You can't even reach anyway, so... Let's just see if you... can kill... this automaton. No, you can't. You might be able to though, and you might be able to then kill this one. Two hits would do it. No. Uh,
you can't get anywhere useful by going this way. Maybe you could just... Oh, you know, you've got 50% defense. Hmm. You could get killed by those two if they're getting up on you, so you go... Maybe the best place for you to be is right where you are. Yeah, probably is. Ah, saw that coming. Go and give the Lady of Light a good beating. What can you get around here? One, one. Who wants the experience? I guess Elinia, really. But then I will need to kill this guy too. Elinia doesn't need to worry about keeping near a healer, that's at least something. Well, I can go up here and be relatively safe. And also useless. Why does everyone want me to use that attack? I guess because it's poison. Alright, you stay where you are and gain the extra hit. Oh no, you don't need to. Okay, change your plan, you come out and get attacked. That's also fine. Here? No! That was cool. Everyone else catch up. Get with the program. You get ready to fight, and you... Coward's way out. Um, you can. We've got a headhunter. Try and block the way to Alinea with my other units. Well, not if I do that, I won't. Alright, good. You come back here to heal this guy if he gets attacked. Um, or maybe you should go there. No. You can get Alinea's healing. <laughs> you, my friend, are not really a threat. And hopefully a level 1 can now claim this kill for their own. Pretty close. Okay. Now, Zephyrs are very useful. They're very annoying if you're an enemy. Um, but I feel like a Grunt would be more helpful because Grunts can level up further and I might easily get to level 3 if this scenario is as long as it seems to look. Alright, can anyone reach? We've got two shapeshifters. Um, we've got this demon.
you won't you won't be able to resist if I've got someone if I've got a troll here, you'll come out and use your arcane attack. And then everyone else can absolutely wail on you. So that would be a beautiful thing to see. Can also put you there. You there. Recruit one more unit. Um, who's good against these guys? Someone who can do fire or arcane, which means a demon, I guess. You get health. And you guys just uh, bring up the rear. There you go. <coughs> So this thing is a Stormblade, it's a level 4 drone unit, which is biomechanical and armoured. It has the Rayblade ability, I believe I did see one of these once before, um, but yeah. Okay, so the first person who's good at taking these guys out is Alinea. And if I go two steps further, then the other shapeshifters will come to attack me and so will this demon. That is okay, I am good with that. Alright, not too much damage. Chill damage isn't great against these guys. I've got you to do fire damage. You'll take quite a lot in return. As will you. What about you? Oh, you're not bad in this situation, you can't kill it though. That's fine though. <coughs> And now... Ah, this demon's called Elo. That's very appropriate. Elo, of course, being the uh, deity who is the Lady of Light in, in the preceding campaign. You'll feed your experience to the level 2 ambusher. And both of you can only reach a linear. I could give you a, another tempting target. Maybe the Demoness Warrior. Who will get healed if wounded. You can come down here. Okay. Alright, this other shapeshifter didn't want to engage, so this is now looking more interesting because we've got the Stormblade creeping up our butt. Um, Elinia can reach the shapeshifter, but only Elinia, and I don't think it's a good idea. Um, so what I'm actually going to do is back everyone up just for this one turn. You can still reach. You can't. Interesting. Okay. I would like you to come in. So I guess I'll have to give you a more tempting target. I think this demon warrior is probably the best bet. How good are you as against the blade again? 20% resistant. Good. Some interesting things could happen this turn if I play it like this, but uh, let's see. Actually, I'm also going to put you there. Why not? Yeah, I knew you'd do that. Get you into the action. Oh, that thing's tough. Alright. So first things first, kill this little demo. You're good against drones, especially if they're slowed. Maybe it wasn't so smart to lure this guy out.
Okay, you're virtually useless. Give you a slow... And then just lay into you. Could kill it here. Probably worth it. Anyone else got range? Oh, you can get through. Okay, so I've got options. Fantastic, and that's a good chunk of experience for you. You're almost at a level now. Is this now enough to... Ooh, what's that? It's a turret. Interesting. It's got a lot of hit points, so I guess I'm going to have to gang up on that if I want to kill it. Is this impassable terrain, or is it just invisible to me? Currently not visible to me. In you go. Alright, you can fight her again and you'll get a level. Not hugely effective because of the physical endurance ability, but still. Okay, Alinea plays another blinder. And the shaman gets the kill. Alright. Let's explore. That is... Well, I'm really not getting any more visibility up there. Who needs health? Only the, only the demons really need healing, so they can start advancing. Nothing down here. Nothing visible. Alinea's health is back up to full. Careful to put no one next to the tower. It's not that good, but just to be careful. Anyone still need healing? No. Nice. Okay. Well, it does do both melee and range attacks, so I will take damage from this if I attack it. Um. Is there any point? The internal question. What about you? How much damage will you do? I'm going to need to kill these ones by the gate, so I guess I should do that first. Um, they're actually harder to kill. I've got a ton of turns left, but probably I'm going to have to sneak all the way up this side of the map. So 40 damage, 38 damage, 
And what you do is 24 damage, so that's 58, 62, 102. Okay, that would be enough. Great, all right. Stick you there to heal. Actually, not there, you go there to heal. Everyone else advance on the other turrets. I've got some skirmishers, so I can get around this one. Oh, sugar. I did that wrong. You only do 24, so I need someone who can do 35. Well, I guess that would be a linear. Okay, there's another shapeshifter back there. Good stuff. rest of you stay where you are, next turn we'll take out this other turret. Could probably just about manage it this turn, but... Well, 24... 24... 12... nah. Not now, anyway. Okay, you didn't move. Perfect. You come in and do 40 damage. And now someone who can do 21 damage, you can get the kill. Who needs it? You need it. There you go, some experience. You can come here, and you guys can advance down the corridor. Not too far, though. This shapeshifter also doesn't want to come out and play. Two shapeshifters. Okay, this is going to be more fun. You can get some backstabbing in. If I let you, which of course I won't.
still the shapeshifters don't want to come. They will only come if they get really, really easy targets, it seems. How good is chill against these guys? Okay, it bypasses their resistance, which is the crucial thing to know. Down you go. Alright, you're getting close to an Amla. You come here and give health. You've done absolutely nothing so far. I don't know why I hired you. At least you're loyal. And you keep scouting. Okay, we've got a Rayblade. Not a problem. So far, it has to be said, this scenario has been long, but not hugely challenging. Or maybe I'm too good at the game. I don't know. find my troll? Any love for the troll? Oh! Yeah, you love the troll and you did, you love it so much that you did uh, 32 flipping damage to it. Okay, let's use, let's adopt the normal protocol for taking out sentry drones. Ilinia, slow and stun it. Not great. That was pretty good though. Can you come and get the kill? Good. And now, unless there are more sentry drones, which there might be. Well, just in case, I'm going to leave everyone mostly out of harm's way. Stick you there, because I don't think anyone in this campaign will be able to one-shot you with Blade, even on 30% defense. But it does lure you out, which Elinia herself might not have done. Okay, let's deal some damage. Great, you've set up a nice kill for someone. any more drones around here. Doesn't look like it. Okay, we've got some regular Chaos Invaders.
Can you pull back? And they didn't want to come out and fight. And to be honest, who can blame them? Okay, there's a Magus behind them, so I would like to lure them out. So in that case, let's get someone you'll be keener to attack, like this level 1 demon. Put you in the water, that might also be tempting. You go there, and I think we should be good. Oh, come on! Alright, I guess I'm going to have to do it the aggressive way. Roar! Dead. Collectively, you guys could deal an awful lot of damage to this guy. Or indeed anyone who's weak who stands there. So I suspect the best bet is just to keep Alinea on the front lines. And let her tank the damage, if anyone does. Next turn I'll clean it up. You step down here. Fantastic. And someone else. You should get the level 2 kill. And maybe. Hello, hello. You get this kill, and we're heading towards the transport access. But there is a big fat dude in the way, or maybe a big fat girl, Ellen, or maybe a big fat non-binary person, who knows. reach and you didn't want to come out and fight my demon warrior that's understandable too take a step forward see if there's anyone behind take another step oh okay there is someone behind and it's a demonic hound that is berserk okay so I don't want most of these units to go down there actually so I want to put someone who's a little bit weaker up in front for the doom guard to come for Unfortunately, the Hound can reach pretty much as far as the Doom Guard can. Uh, how about that? Okay, that ought to do it. Still no? Really? Alright, I guess I'm just going to have to play this smart. That's interesting. Probably that's an error, I think. Shouldn't be able to see through that wall, really. I wonder if this will all link back round. This passageway doesn't look like it ought to lead anywhere sensible. I'm gonna put the uh, troll warrior there, because if he wants to fight, if the, if the wolf wants to fight him, that's fine. <gasps> 
Oh, sugar, there's a turret there. I didn't even notice that. Okay. Um, uh, don't panic. I don't want to lose my Team and S Warrior, but still shouldn't do, I think. How did I miss that? I must be blind. Bloody hell. Alright. Okay, there are certainly a fair few chunky units here, and the turret doesn't seem to want to attack. So, let's slow the turret with a linear. Let's finish you. How good are you against... Eh, not bad. I'd rather not attack you straight away, though. Could send you round to attack the turret, but whoever goes there is going to get... Hmm. It's a tricky one. Maybe sacrificial regular demon time. You should get the kill straightforwardly. Alright, now I can reach round. Most of my units ought to be no-brainers to kill that hound. take on the hounds, you've got much better stats. <coughs> and now you're almost at a level, which is fantastic. You can come here and uh, help with the healing efforts. You can be scout a little bit ahead. Alright, we can see what looks like the end of the map, I think. Useful to proceed after healing. Probably Alinea needs to go there, so I'll move her as fast as she can. Everyone else gather around to be heliod. Is there going to be elevator music in here? It looks like a very elevatory elevator. Here we go. We must all enter the transport room together. Nobody should be left behind. All good. I can actually fit them all. I guess that's why you're only allowed eight units. So who can reach the back corner? Most people can. You can. The people who can only reach close by squares are the ones I need to worry about. You guys don't care. You, you, and you. 
now you would Yeah, we're good. Now what? Rumbling. The transporter abruptly stops. I recognize this corridor. Onwards! Okay. We have to proceed further underground. We're not going to do that yet, though, because this is where I'm going to take a break. And thank you for watching. See you next time.